get started? Right. Okay. All right, everyone. Welcome to a meeting of Lumbersexuals Anonymous. Now, this is an open meeting of Lumbersexuals, and we are all glad you're here, especially newcomers. Now, just a uh, quick reminder in keeping the singleness of purpose of Lumbersexuals Anonymous, all discussions should be confined to being a Lumbersexual. Timber! All right, at this time, I would like to ask if there are any newcomers. Yeah. And if so, please stand up and introduce yourself. <laughs> Hi, uh, my name is Adam. Or if sitting makes you more comfortable, you may sit down. Okay. Um, so like I said, my name's Adam, and I've been a practicing lumber sexual for three months now. I'm not really sure when it started. It might have been an issue of GQ that I was reading while having my hair styled, or whenever we're sharing that Hey Arnold voice actor photo on Facebook. But um, either way, I bought a few flannel shirts and started growing out my beard, and I'm just here to admit that I need help. Timber! Thank you for sharing, Adam. That was very brave. Evan, why don't you give us an update from last week? And I think now would be a good time to say that what is said here stays here. We will share our experiences, our strengths, our hope, what it was like, what happened, and what it's like now. Go ahead, Evan. <clears throat> well, as most of you know, I'm one of the oldest lumber sexuals here, and uh, most of you also know that I've got a pension for younger trees. And uh, last Tuesday I was gallivanting through the forest, and I came upon her. The most beautiful red oak I have ever seen. So I made my way over to her and started chatting her up, and look, I swear to God that they card in this part of the woods. I swear. Anyway. Long story short, I thought my dendrochronology was better than it is, and apparently she only had 17 rings, so needless to say, I'm not allowed in the Sherwood Forest anymore. Timber! Wait, what What? What kind of story was that? Is he, he's talking about having sex with an underage tree? I mean, who, I, I'm sorry, but I, like, I'm here for real support. I spent... $2,300 at L.L. Bean the last Adam. 10 days, okay? I bought duck boots. Who needs Look, duck boots? This is, doesn't even snow here. Adam, this is a battle for everyone. And it is not a place of judgment. Okay. Uh, Lonnie, let's get an update on that sticky situation. It's not good, Paul. It's okay. not good. We can work, uh, Lonnie, we can uh, talk, we can work uh, through this. Uh, mm, it's not good, oh. No. Oh yeah, but it feels so good. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm, it feels so good. But so bad. It's not, oh, it feels so good. But it's so bad. Timber! No, are you serious right now, bro? You're pouring maple syrup all over yourself like that? Just indoors, maple syrup everywhere? Okay, I'm the one that came here for support. I bought a woodcutting axe even though I live in an efficiency yeah, apartment in the middle of the city. I'm sorry, I I, the only time I go outdoors is to Instagram photos of myself. I Adam! Don't support Listen. We come in here for support. And by joining this group, you are accepting the responsibility to lend out a helping hand to others who need it. Now, there's no room for judgment, and there is no room for criticism, and there is no room for a sense of entitlement and superiority. So I need you to shut the fuck up and, 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 and help these people or go. Now, I don't normally allow my dark side to come out like this, but you have given me no choice. So please be considerate. Tell Lonnie you're sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Timothy, how are you doing with your squirrel play? Oh, well, my little squirrely has been gobbling up my nuts. 
What the actual fuck? <laughs>